Hello, how to solve this problem? 3 raised to the power x plus 2 plus 9 raised to the power x minus 1 equals to 90. From here, let's change everything to have the same base of 3. And here, this will be 3 raised to the power x plus 2 plus. Here become 3 raised to the power 2. Then multiply by x minus 1. Here can be written as 3 raised to the power 2. Then times 10. Because 3 raised to the power 2 is 9, 9 times 10, same thing as 90. Then from here, we can write this again as 3 raised to the power x plus 2 plus 3 raised to the power 2 x minus 2. When 2 open this bracket, then equals to 3 raised to the power 2 times 10. Then from here, let's divide through by 3 raised to the power 2. In order to remove it on this side, divide by 3 raised to the power 2, then divide by 3 raised to the power 2. And uh, applying the law of indices from here, when we apply the law of indices, we subtract this power from here because when the same base divide, we subtract their power. And this will become 3 raised to the power x plus 2 minus 2. Then same thing here, we have 3 raised to the power 2x minus 2, then minus 2. So the 3 raised to the power 2 cancel each other here, then equals to 10. Then the next step, this will reduce to 3 raised to the power x minus 2 minus 2, 0, then plus 3 raised to the power 2x minus 4, then equals to 10. Minus 2 minus 2 minus 4. Then also, we can write this again and uh, in another way, and this will become 3 raised to the power x plus 3 raised to the power 2x divided by 3 raised to the power 4. So we reverse that law of indices, then equals to 10. And 3 raised to the power 4, same thing as 81. And then uh, when we write this again now, we have 3 raised to the power x plus 3 raised to the power 2x over 81 then equals to 10 we can clear this fraction multiplying through by 81 which is the SEM here so when we multiply through by 81 this become 81 times 3 raised to the power x then plus 81 times this 81 we cancel 81 then this is 3 raised to the power 2x then equals to 81 times 10, that's 810. And when we solve further from here, we can rearrange this to form an equation. And then uh, take 2 out of the bracket, we have 3 raised to the power x, then raised to the power 2, then plus 81 times 3 raised to the power x, then take 810 here, and that becomes minus 810 which is equals to 0. And from here, we can use a letter to represent 3 raised to the power x. So let t be equals to 3 raised to the power x. And this equation can be written again as t squared plus 81t then minus 810 equals to 0. And when we solve this particular equation, which is quadratic equation using the quadratic formula. So t can be written, t will now be equal to minus 81, that's minus b, plus or minus square root of b square, that's 81 square, then minus 4a, a here is 1, then c, c is minus 8, then, then, which will be, a, which will be divided by 2a, and 2a, that's 2 times 1. And then when we simplify further from here, we have t to be equals to minus 81 plus or minus square root of 81 square will give us 6,561, then plus, minus times minus become plus, then 4 times 810, we have 3,240, then divided by 2 times 1, that's 2. And when we add that together, so we have t to be equals to minus 81 plus or minus square root of 
9801 then divided by 2 t is equals to minus 81 plus or minus square root of this we give us 99 then over 2 when we separate it we have two values of t the first value of t that's t1 will be equals to minus 81 plus 99 that will give us 18 that's 18 over 2 and that is 9 so the second value of t t2 will be equals to minus 81 minus 99 and that is minus 180 divided by 2 and that is equals to minus 90 and the value of t what we use to represent t is 3 raised to power x so t from t equals to 3 raised to power x here this is positive and we have negative here so there won't be a solution here then when we work with 9 so we say t is equal to 9 and t is equal to 3 raised to power x that means 3 raised to power x now is equal to 9 so we can change 9 to have base 3 as well and from here we have 3 raised to power x equals to 3 square because 3 square is 9 the base are now equal we equate the power and that means x equals to 2 so to check from what we are given we have 3 raised to power x plus 2 plus 9 raised to power x minus 1 equals to 90 now that we get x to be equal to 2 put 2 here now that's 2 plus 2 here that's 4 that's 3 raised to power 4 plus 9 raised to power 2 minus 1 that's same thing as 9 raised to power 1 which is 9 is this equals to 90 and from here 3 raised to power 4 that's 81 we have 81 plus 9 will this give us 90 and when we add this together this is 90 which is equals to 90 the right the left hand side is equals to the right hand side therefore we can conclude that x is equals to 2 thank you for watching also give this video a share and don't hesitate to subscribe to this channel so as not to miss out from any of our uploads see you in the next class and bye for now